Hi guys, today's topic is the difference between VoLTE, Warner, and Wi-Fi calling. Unlike 2G and 3G networks where you have one part of the network for voice calls and SMS and another part for mobile data or internet, in 4G and 5G networks everything is based on IP. So everything is internet based. 4G networks enable voice calls and SMS using VoLTE technology, so voice over LTE. 5G networks enable voice calls and SMS using voice over and R technology. And of course, Wi-Fi calling is common between 4G and 5G both. So let's dive in. Before diving into the details, let's have a look at a simplified view of a mobile network. So starting from the left side of this diagram, you have a user device, which can be your mobile phone or mobile broadband router with a SIM card inside. The phone makes a connection with the radio network, which is linked to the core network. The core network connects your phone to the outside world, so there will be networks like the mobile networks, landline network, and more importantly, for IP services, the internet. VoLTE, voice over NR, and Wi-Fi calling only take place in 4G and 5G networks and not in 2G or 3G networks. The core network in 4G is called Evolved Packet Core, or EPC, and the core network in 5G is called 5GCN, or 5G Cloud Native Core Network. 4G networks are based on LTE technology and 5G networks are based on NR technology. Both 4G and 5G networks are IP only, which means that uh, they offer voice and text, so SMS services, using a different approach than the earlier 2G and 3G networks. 2G and 3G networks employ two technologies. So you have circuit switching, CS, and packet switching, PS. Circuit switching for voice calls and texts, and packet switching for mobile data. From 4G onwards, so 4G and 5G networks, all services are delivered through the packet switch part of the mobile network. However, doing so requires a new network entity called IMS, IP Multimedia Subsystem, within the overall mobile network. IMS works with the mobile core network to enable rich communication services whilst ensuring the required quality of service QoS. So, to re-emphasize, 4G LTE networks deliver all cellular services including voice calls and texts through the IP network and therefore require the packet switched capability. 4G LTE networks do not have a circuit switch part. VoLTE, voice over LTE, is the technology in LTE network that enables IP-based voice calls and text messages. It means that 4G networks do not offer voice calls and text messages using traditional circuits, but instead used a managed VoIP voice over IP technology. As a backup, 4G LTE networks have a 2G, 3G fallback option called Circuit Switch Fallback or CSFB. CSFB allows a mobile phone to switch to the 2G or 3G networks for voice calls and text messages. So what happens in VoLTE is that the mobile phone establishes a connection with the radio network. The radio network connects to the 4G core network EPC, Evolve Packet Core, and the EPC works with IP Multimedia Subsystem, IMS, to enable rich communications including voice calls and text messages, SMS. There is no involvement of your Wi-Fi network here, so I have graded out here, so you know that the Wi-Fi network is not involved in VoLTE. Warner or Voice over NR is the capability in the fifth generation of mobile networks that delivers voice calls and text messages over the IP network using packet switch network. VoLTE and Voner are counterparts and do the same thing in 4G and 5G networks. Therefore, Voner is also called Voice over 5G. For Voice over NR to function, a mobile network requires a dedicated 5G core network, so 5GCN, to work with IMS IP multimedia subsystem. If you look at this diagram for Voice over NR, you will see a similar architecture where the phone connects to the radio network, which then connects to the core network. 
Since voice over NR requires a 5G core network, you see a 5G cloud native core network here instead of a 4G core network. Also, since standalone 5G networks are the ones that use a 5G core network, you can expect Warner in standalone 5G or 5G SA. In non standalone 5G or 5G NSA, where a 4G core network EPC is used, the voice calls and text messages are enabled by the Vol TE technology instead of Warner. Wi-Fi calling or voice over Wi-Fi allows any cellular device to connect to the 4G or 5G mobile network through a Wi-Fi network. So if you are in an area with no cellular coverage, with Wi-Fi calling, you can still make and receive phone calls and send and receive text messages as long as you're connected to a Wi-Fi network. Of course, not every phone supports Wi-Fi calling, so you will need Wi-Fi calling support on your phone. For Wi-Fi calling to take place, the mobile network requires a new network entity called Evolved Packet Data Gateway, EPDG. EPDG works as an adapter to connect any online cellular device to the mobile network in a highly secure way. EPDG establishes a secure connection with a Wi-Fi connected phone using IPsec. IPsec, or Internet Protocol Security, is a network protocol for encrypting data packets. EPDG connects to the 4G or 5G core network, which then works with IMS to enable voice calls and text messages. So that's it guys, that's how it works at a high level. And just remember, these diagrams are highly simplified. Thanks for watching the video guys, I've written a detailed post on this topic and the link is in the description. And if you like this video, please hit the like button and make sure to subscribe to the channel because I'm posting new videos all the time.